Welcome back to The Sims 4 High School Years Rags to Riches. Thanks to EA Creator Network for making this early access video possible. All right, we're back at prom, exactly where we left off. Where is my prom date? Let's, ch let's check this place out. So we've got a dance, the vote for prom royalty and grab a drink. Sydney, oh, there you are. <laughs> yeah. Enthuse about learning additional skill. No, let's maybe not. <laughs> let's maybe not. Let's, can I, can I, do I have like a, Let's banter with my BFF. At least I'm like in a relatively good mood. That's kind of nice. Oh yeah. I don't know if this music is going to be copyright. Can I change it? Hmm. It doesn't seem to be any options to change it. So let's just hope it's fine. Hey Sydney. Oh, are we going to talk across the dance floor like this? Yeah, let's just talk right here. <laughs> yeah, let's just talk right here. That's cool. I think we're having a positive interaction, which is pretty rare uh, for Reginald. It doesn't always happen. Um, let's also... So wait, hang on, if I click, oh wait, I was on here. Sweetheart dance together. Oh, okay, I can just choose anyone. Hmm. Eh, Sydney, let's have a dance. You know, let's have fun. Oh, the principal. <laughs> the chaperone, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, these people are just sitting down on the sides. Oh, we're dancing over here, off the dance floor in the back of the room. Okay, I mean, I guess that's cool. Let's have a look. So this is what the auditorium looks like for pro, oh my gosh. Holy, look how much food there is. They have literal whole, what, are those chickens or turkeys? <laughs> They have how many roast chickens? They have 15 of them. Um, and no sides or condiments, just whole straight up roast chickens all throughout this place. But yeah, look at this, look at this, look at us. Look at us right now. Who would have thought the socially awkward Reginald would have actually got a prom date? I mean, granted we're here as just friends, but won't always be that way. It's how it starts, you know. Oh, are you showing me something? I feel like you're not talking to me because I have no interaction here. All right, let's go grab, <laughs> grab one of the 15 turkeys and let's have some food. Mmm, fruit punch, yummy. Am I eating my turkey? I mean my chicken. Okay, I sat down there, I'm going back over there. Oh yeah, look at Sydney go. Hey, what's up? Hey, okay, no, I'm just coming to talk to you, but that's cool. No, that's all right, I'll, um, I'll hang out over here. Okay, so apparently a uh, sweetheart dance didn't count as a dance. Um, I guess I have to dance by myself, which I mean, that's fine, I guess. How much time do I have, by the way? Not a lot. I got two and a half hours left. Oh, dang, Cassandra is going for it. Did you see that? Okay, you gotta stop eating now. Like, I know we don't often have food or money, mind you, but we don't have a huge amount of time here. So we just gotta, we just gotta do it. Let's try and get our, get our uh, stuff going on here. All right, dancing. Let's join the D floor. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Reginald, with the moves. Ooh, yeah. Check me out. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Look at me go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's my man. That's what I'm talking about. Do I even know you? Declan. Apparently I do know you. Let's flash my crazy eyes. You gonna do it? You gonna do it? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Dude, wait, why? Uh, why, why, why is your award ceremony already happening? It's only nine o'clock. I haven't voted yet. Ah, oh, dang it. I feel like all these... Okay, I wasted a lot of time here. Okay, that's enough dancing. Stop. Stop. There's no time. I need to use photo booth. <laughs> Take a photo with Sydney. Where are you? I don't know if this is gonna work because they're all like obsessed with the, the award ceremony right now. Hey Sydney, you wanna go take a photo in the photo booth? I, I want my prom to be a good experience. It's supposed to be the most important night of my life. I think he said yes. You, you say yes? Are we, are we going? I don't think so. No, I want to. Oh, no, we're just listening. I, I, okay, take a whole photo. Let's go, go to the booth. I don't care. Oh, wait, what's happening? What's happening? Attention everybody, we have the results of the winners of the prom court. I'm happy to announce the following winners. Prom royalty, Reginald Big Wallet. I don't know how that happened. I'm the most disliked, uh, socially awkward person. This is gonna be a prank. Hang on, is this a classic high school prank where they like all vote for the weird kid and then make fun of me for it? That's not cool, guys. And then the prom jester is Kevin Puri. Congratulations, take a moment. Oh my gosh, I, I, I'm, I'm legitimately surprised. Did, do, do we have any, did anyone vote? Is that why? Oh my gosh, this is the most important night of my life. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just so happy. All my life I've wanted to be prom royalty, can't you tell? Can you not tell how happy I am right now? Yeah. All right, that's what I'm talking about. That's rags to riches done. We are royalty. Oh, that's actually really cute. It's got like a little plum bob in the front. <laughs> All right, that's pretty cool. Can, can we please take a photo in the photo booth now? <laughs> Sydney, please. I just want a photo with my prom date. I mean, this is gonna be a sick prank, right? Why, why? <laughs> Nobody like them. I mean, the only person that likes me is Sydney. Literally everyone else kind of hates me. Cassandra kind of likes me, but everyone else is just like, no, this guy sucks. <laughs> 
Are we good? Are we, are we? Yes, we're taking a photo. Yeah. We can also take a photo on this wall too, which we should do. All right, let's go to the photo booth. First time using it. Oh yeah, thumbs up. Thanks. Thanks Silas. All right, take photos. What does it look like inside? Oh, nothing. Yeah, cool. <laughs> like, oh, I did get the photo for it though. Can I see it? <laughs> really? Yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about. I, I think it was, they were pranking me. Like, probably, yeah, right. Loser. <laughs> Also, I just used the photo booth, but I guess that didn't count for some reason. Um, okay. Look, I'm trying. Oh, now what? Go, go over there and quick! Any more time? Quick! Get the photo done! We have 10 minutes! Ah, oh, yes. Whew. We at least got a bronze. All right. Can I gossip with you real quick? I've got to gossip with someone. Prom, show off crown. No, I don't care about that. I need gossip. 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 Where is it? <laughs> quick! Oh, yeah. They like my photo. Hey, do you hear, do you hear about prom royalty? Yeah, it's me. Oh, dang it. It's too late. Okay, we can't really see each other. There's kind of flowers in the way here. <laughs> Let's keep this party going. Want to come to the after party? Yes, with friends. Uh, Sydney, where's... Oh, there you are. You're coming with me. Let's go. Where's this after party at? Oh, also, I feel like I should point out I've had this scratch on my, my forehead. I know it may seem like I've had a scratch on my forehead for like weeks and you might be concerned that I'm like not healing, but I just want you guys to know that the early access for this pack, we have like four days to record for like, and I'm trying to get like two weeks of videos. So I'm okay. <laughs> Just so you know, cause this is like, in, annoyingly, it's like in all of these videos. Alrighty, after party at the pier. <gasps> let's go down of love. Ride, romantic ride with Sydney. Yes, let's go. Hey, I don't know. You want, you want to go on the tunnel of love together? I mean, it'd be kind of funny. You know, <laughs> you know like as a joke, you know, wouldn't that be funny? <laughs> yeah, let's go. It's time! The Tunnel of Love! <laughs> yeah! No, we're just, we're, we're just, at this point, just friends, you know? We're not quite sure. We're not quite sure. But here we go. Mmm. <laughs> uh -huh, uh -huh, yeah. Oh, here we, oh, okay. Here we go. Just friends. Reginald has decided he wants to talk to Sydney about their relationship. <laughs> yeah, let's go to the Tunnel of Love. This is the place that we're gonna really figure things out. And what better way to communicate a serious relationship than through a cheesy plum bite peer attraction? Also, peer is spelt wrong. Um, <laughs> just a uh, spell check. Uh, <laughs> it's that twinkle in Sydney's eye, a hint of attraction or irritation from the atmospheric fog being pumped into the room. Does he try out the smolder and attempt to win Sydney over, or does he try to de-escalate the romance and encourage a stronger friendship? Ah, keep floating. I mean, this is this is like a, you know, a teenage crush. Let's go. Wow, we this sim that sim is irresistible. Reginald has a major crush. Yeah, Reginald has learned Sydney's romantic orientation. Let's go. Whoa, okay, there's so many things. Hang on, I gotta, I gotta get through all these. Nothing says I want to be more than friends than being stuck on a ride with someone while you're surrendered, serenaded, sorry, by the smooth sound of Frank the Flying Womp Womp. The two flirt for the entire ride, keeping within respectful boundaries, but also not backing down. <laughs> Nothing too exciting happened, but something has sparked within Sydney's heart that could be the perfect opportunity for Reginald to, Reginald to pursue a relationship. Will they or won't they? Maybe you'll find out in the Cuddle Cuts, the sequel. <laughs> Gained romance between writers. Started crushing on Ryder. So I think, is a crush is, is that a new thing? Um, um I'm kind of, uh, how does that work? Where is Sydney? Hello? There you are. So, oh yeah, crush. Enamored sentiment. Reginald is crushing hard on Sydney. So Sydney has romantic exploration. As I think that's a thing you said in Creator Sim. I think, I don't know. I'm, I'm not too up to date on all these new things and how that works. Cause I, I mean, I, <laughs> I don't really know how Creator Sim works, but you know, I think we're both, we both seem to be pretty happy about it. You know, I think it's my crown. I, I, I think it's my crown to be honest. And also the fact that we got this far, but yeah, I'm gonna be, let's confess to being socially awkward. If you didn't already know that. <laughs> now, actually, I've got a question. Romantic interest, because okay, so I already know your romantic interest. Can I, uh, oh, reveal crush. Declare love publicly? Oh, that's socially awkward. Let's to keep it on the DL. At least to start off with. How do I find out um, Sim's pronouns? Because I don't know if I've been saying the wrong pronouns with Sydney. I'm a little concerned. What if I modify and cast? Hang on. Because I know some of these pre-made sims have set pronouns. 
But I don't know how to f see them in gameplay, and I don't want to get it wrong. Change pronouns. Okay, I think he is just he, him, because it, it's no, it's not set. Okay, I just checked the trailer. It is he, him. I wasn't actually sure, but okay, we're good. All right, where were we? Sorry. <laughs> Let me flash my crazy eyes. I know how well that works. Now, did I, did I confess? I don't think I did confess my social awkwardness. Um, I would like to do that though. <laughs> Am I doing this right? Is this just how you flirt? <laughs> <laughs> Crazy eyes. I mean, I never really. Oh, wait. I don't think he liked that. Oh, I think I kind of killed the mood. Man, I'm not, I'm not quite sure if I'm, I'm, I'm doing this thing right. Oh, I'm feeling flirty though. I'm flirty. I mean, Sydney's not. So that. that, that um, he, uh, he seems receptive. That didn't seem too bad. Oh. Oh, <laughs> I was like, oh my God, what did I do? Our relationship. No, no, that's just another sim that's inserted themselves into our conversation. Leave me alone, please. I'm trying to have a moment here. Ask it, I'm gonna, you know, that's us. Oh, okay, all right. Um, okay, ha are you all right? Sydney? <laughs> Wait, how did you, oh, moon is probably the option. I was like, you can't stargaze without outdoor retreat, but I think it's moon bathing. Um, Sydney, Sydney, Sydney. Um, okay, yeah, like I know I'm socially awkward, but like, Hang on, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna go first person. There we go. Uh, Sydney? <clears throat> um, yeah, um, yeah, I know. I mean, this is kind of awkward. Um, <laughs> what are you doing? Get up! Why? <laughs> um, all right, well, I guess we had a good night. It is 1 a.m. Maybe, I guess I'll, uh, I'll leave you there. I'll, I'll leave you to it. Um, uh, no, I, I I, I was gonna like maybe move things to the next level, but oh, you're getting up. Okay, you know we'll just do a, a little bit of flirting. You know, just a, just a little hee hee ha ha's. Okay, now we're we're off. Where are we going? Oh no, we're doing the Simsaw thing where we walk to the other side of the world before we discuss anything. Okay, are we gonna? Are we? Oh, okay, are we um. How, how far are we gonna walk here? Cause I don't. My house is over that way. Um, guys. Okay. <laughs> okay, you can stop. <laughs> Where are you going? Oh my gosh. All right, let's. All right, nobody's going through the whole park. Okay. Where are we going and why? Oh, we're. Oh, oh. Oh, okay. I didn't. I, <laughs> I see. I see what's going on. Oh, I really got to go to the toilet. Well, you know, now that you're, we're alone, um, are, are you single? I don't know. This, this, I probably should ask that first. And then, just a little bit of floating. Sydney is single. Let's go. Just a, you know, just a little. Hey man, looking good. I, I, I mean, I, that tie <laughs> looks good. Slimming, which is surprising because stripes usually aren't slimming. But on you they are. I'm gonna show off my muscles. I'm gonna check out my muscles. I'm super not ripped. <laughs> hey, check this out. Check this out. You ready for this? I don't think you're ready for this. I feel like I'm not showing off my muscles. I, I was trying to do a cool pose, but it didn't work. Um, well, you know, I gotta go to the toilet, so I'm gonna do that. You're welcome to stay. Um, oh, hi. Okay, everyone's coming in here. I mean, occupied. Uh, occupied. <laughs> Alrighty. Um, can I, you know what? I'm gonna ask you for social advice because I, you are literally my only friend. Everyone else is just an acquaintance or worse. <laughs> Yeah, friends, Sydney. <laughs> hey man, do you have any do you have any advice how I can be like less awkward? Uh, okay, he's just checking his phone. Cool. All right, so I guess you didn't have any advice then. Anyway, I guess I'm gonna do a post. I'm gonna do a new post. Oh, here we go. What have we got? Post about the photo. Why can't I post about winning prom royalty? Yeah, like, hello. Do you see how royal I was? Uh, I guess I'll post about my photo booth. Um. I'm gonna say the confident narrative in the photo booth because I'm from the royalty. <laughs> Strike a pose, how fierce. These photos are model quality. I got some messages too, hello. Wait, these are all zero minutes ago. How many messages do I have? Oh wait, no, I think it's just messed up. Okay, hang on. Reginald, you look like a shaved llama. I don't know who I said that to. Reginald, we should get together and hang out sometime. Ah, oh, cool. The lunch lady. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's the cafeteria worker. Um. Uh, I don't know about that one. Wouldn't it be so terrible if you happen to find some sabotage objects in your future? Oh, Cassandra, I'm so happy to have a friend like you. I feel like we're not friends, but yeah, me too. Um, all right, well, what, what's glowing? Something's glowing on my calendar. Is it this? We've got uh, career day on Thursday and football team sports day. Okay, cool. My teen birthday is there. That's fine. Uh, well, I'm gonna go home. Can I, can I like say goodnight to you or is that like not a thing? Like, I, I want to say like goodbye. I don't, I don't want to just like leave, but 
I think there's really an option for that, so I guess I'll leave. Oh, I just accidentally selected Sydney and the other person to travel with me. So they're gonna they're gonna see how I live. Oh, why did why did you come with me? Go away. Alright, you go home and I'll say can I say now that you're here, can I say goodbye? Like nicely. Uh, <laughs> give relationship advice. Yeah, yeah. Uh okay, that doesn't seem to be an option to say goodbye. I mean I guess I can just send you home. Alright, go away. See you guys, I gotta go to bed. Alright, my needs are pretty good. Just a little tired and a little hungry. Hopefully those clothes sell. Oh wait, why is it not for I thought I set it for sale. Oh, okay, I guess I didn't. Wait, what's this? It's almost as if someone is controlling his life. Will Reginald finally fulfill his dreams or will whoever is controlling his life stop his wishes from coming true? Dang! Excuse you? I'm trying! It's tough! It's tough being a teenager and having to go to school. I mean, this is Rags to Riches, what, episode four? Where are we up to? I don't know what episode this is. But we have three Somalis. It's rough out here. I'm doing my best, okay? So I guess we did 165 before. Maybe it was too much. Let's do 160. What's that? Reactor first. Puberty changes. Uh-oh. What's my puberty change? Oh, I have acne. Uh -oh. oh, no. Yeah. <laughs> I think my favorite thing about teenagers in Sims 4 is they look like they're 30 years old. <laughs> so it's like, oh, first puberty changes, yet already looks like a full grown adult. All right, we're hungry. We got some photos. Can I put these out yet? I need like a table, but I can't do it. Uh-oh. Looming anxiety. That anxious feeling looms over Reginald as he discovers something new about himself. A fear wasn't there before. Growing inside, ready to overcome Reginald into paralysis at any moment. Fear from unfulfilled dreams. Ugh, I, got, I have two fears. Fear of a dead end job and fear of an unfulfilled dream. <laughs> I'm not sure how to get rid of these. I guess I just have to do the opposite of what they're saying. So I have to fulfill dreams. But what's my dreams like this? Look, I'm trying, it's tough. I can't do homework until next week, okay? <laughs> I'm so tense. Languishing skills. It's been far too long since Reginald has worked on developing any of his skills, okay. Uh, well maybe, missing out on dreams. Ugh, God. God, I'm living a rough life. I guess that's probably because of my um, overachiever trait, right? Like I'm trying to, I wanna get stuff done. Well, if, hopefully, if I um, get my mixology skill up, number one, he'll, you know, have achieved something. So that'll be good for overachiever. Number two, maybe that'll help my fear of dead end job because I'll get a, hopefully get a promotion. So uh, where can I go to a bar? I don't think there's anyone in this world. Is there? Mixology, mixology. I think I have to go somewhere else. Oh, we get to go to a base game world. Let's go to Oasis Springs. Let's travel to Rattlesnake Juice Bar. Can I even use the, as, the bar as a teen? I don't know, surely. How would I get my mixology skill up otherwise? Okay, I can practice drinks and stuff though. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go here. I'm also gonna say, hi, I'm gonna talk to you. Friendly introduction. And I'm gonna say, let's like chat here. And then that should pull them off the bar. Hang on. Okay, no, it didn't work. Actions form. Hey, how come I can form a group with you? But I couldn't, with my cheerleading buddies. Add to group. Oh, too busy working. Okay, no, I can't. Um, confess daydream about crush. Okay, I'm gonna <laughs> let the bartender know. Okay, can I use the bar? I just need, oh, here we go. Yes, 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 make drink. Oh, can I just practice making drinks? I'm too tense. Oh, dang it. I'm still tense. Intimidating environment. Oh no, everyone's coming in. I just wanna use the bar. Oh, there's another bartender here now? No, go away. Okay, I'll grab some chips, I am hungry. <laughs> can I have a bowl of chips? Thank you. Okay, can I not be very tense for a minute? 40 minutes left, okay. An event. I think does venting help? I'm gonna guess that it maybe helps. I don't know. I don't think it did anything. Okay. Can I, hang on, prepare for next task. Let's make myself energized. Or not, that didn't prepare. Come on, stop being tense. Be happy. <laughs> God, and I got my puberty reaction one down here too. Okay, that one's going away. I'm, okay, now I'm just angry. Is that okay? Can I, okay, I can do it now. Okay, I need to talk to you. Hi, and then can I say, let's go here. I think it just, it just kind of busted. Yes, I'm in. Haha! <laughs> Don't mind if I do! Let's go! Quiet mixology skill? Yes I did. Okay, if I get to level 2, which I think th that's this one, right? Yeah, so when I get to the top of this, I'll be good for my work anyway. As a, <laughs> as a I guess a barista? There we go. Level 2, we've leveled up. That's gonna make him feel happy too. Alright, let's now, what else do I have to do? Practice cheer. I need to get my fitness level up probably. Let's go, let's go to school on a Sunday. I know, with that kid. Look, we're an overachiever, all right? All right, let's go borrow. Actually, let's do my cheer practice first. Oh, gosh. Oh, I need to buy the bike. Oh, I have no money. That's right, never mind. <laughs> I can't buy a bike anyway. I got no money. Oh, very angry again. Uh, can't focus on every task. It's just too much to prepare for at once. Okay, I don't know what that's in relation to, but anyway, let's do some cheer practice. There we are. So we completed my cheer practice for cheer squad. Oh, now I'm very sad. Unfulfilled dreams. <laughs> 
Yeah, you live a tough life. Right, you need to go to the toilet. Let's go all the way down here now. Oh, I can cry in there too. Let's do that. <laughs> Just let myself into the school. Uh oh, now I'm very angry again. Losing control. Man, you, yeah, your emotions are all over the place. I guess it makes sense. Yeah, that's puberty for you, isn't it? Yeah, let's take a shower. Take a cold shower to calm down a little bit. That should help. Yeah, that brings it down a little bit quicker. There we are. And now let's do some enraged reps. Oh, I'm no longer enraged. Hang on. Do energized workout. All right, let's go! Get ripped! <laughs> I don't really need this right now, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Fitness level three. Let's go energized endurance run. Push the limits. Let's go. Is there a um, cafeteria? What? No, they're not here. <laughs> Be funny though. I, I, I do find it a little surprising that you can just kind of come to the school. Whenever, it's handy. I don't think a lot of schools are like that. I definitely couldn't go to my high school just on a Sunday for fun, especially not at midnight <laughs> with school in the morning. All right, let's go home. We do need to sleep a little bit. Not, not a huge amount, but I think I want to start the week, at least maybe with full energy. That'd be nice. I work in an hour, that's good. All right, let's get up for work. He's actually in a pretty good mood for work, which is surprising, that's usually not the case. I mean, apart from the fact that he's uncomfortable and incredibly hungry, but that's okay. <laughs> oh, new beans. What have we got? New beans. Reginald is contentedly, contentedly grinding his favorite blends, Java Lab and Captain John's Cleanse, when he notices a new variety of bean in the shipment. He takes a whiff, noting that the caramel overtones an approachable aroma beneath. There's no label. Should he brew a batch or try mixing it with something else? Brew it up. Let's go. Oh, nothing ventured, nothing gained. Reginald brews up a fresh pot, labeling it Midnight Magic and slapping it on, uh, slapping an organic sticker on the side. You can't just do that. Customer after customer orders a cup only to dump it out and demand a, re a different refill. When his manager comes back from a break, he tastes it. Jumps upon and asks for Java Lamp. Well, if you're, you taste it, you don't just brew coffee and be like, yeah, that's fine. You brew it, taste it, make sure it's okay, and then sell it. So yeah, honestly, Reginald, you do perform, deserve performance loss on that. Like, I'm not surprised. <laughs> I, I'm not surprised by that. All right, we got uh, school in an hour. Well, let's go ahead and get there now, as usual. Let's also just, uh, you know, I'm going to start changing my school uniform before I go, because like, yeah, yeah, I know you're hungry. We'll go to school in a second. Do I have bills? What's going on with my bills, by the way? It's, I'm 135. Ugh. I guess we'll get that. Actually, I think we get the bills today. And I don't, I don't have enough money for it. All right, nice early morning at school. Hey, everyone, it's prom royalty. <laughs> That's right. Let's order food from my best friend who asked me to hang out. Let's get, you know, I'm feeling pretty luxurious today. I'm going to go all the way for hamburger sliders. Four dollars. That's right. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. Wait, okay, there you go. I was gonna say, where are you going? <laughs> what does that sign say? No stepping on the grass. No walking on the grass. A nice garden. Don't walk through it, please. All right. Starting the week off pretty good, honestly. Oh, they're thinking about me. What's up? Yeah, that's right. I'm prom royalty. That's right. I also drive my own car. It may be a race car bed, but you know, I still consider it a car. <laughs> oh my gosh, I actually had a positive interaction. <laughs> That's surprising. Um, friendly, confess, daydream out, crush. N no, that's probably not a good opener. Um, <laughs> let's, uh, wait, what was the other one? Convince to join team. Well, I don't feel like I know you that well. How's about that day? How are you going? All right, I got to work out on an exercise machine. All right, try to talk to Les. Oh no, she didn't like that. Okay, sorry. Sorry, all right, I'm out. Let's go downstairs. <laughs> Sorry for ruining your day. <laughs> Sorry for ruining your day before it even started. Yep, that'll happen. All right, let's do some weights again. Yep, there we are. Ugh, get them good, nice morning workout in. There we are. Study for exams. Let's do that. I'm going to try and get a perfect score. To, what's my... How am I still a C student? How do I get to the next level? <laughs> it's been like a week of school and I'm still like... Well, I guess C isn't failing. But I haven't like improved. I feel like I've been doing pretty well. I guess not. I guess my needs maybe have just been so bad that it's just been really hard to get it. All right, so we are actually done with our daily tasks. Well, not daily tasks, our morning tasks. Let's um go back upstairs so I'm closer to the classroom because... Oh my God, tea posing. Yeah, that's cool. Is that what the new kids are doing? That was a, that was a thing. That was like a meme for a while where, where people would go around and tea pose. I mean, I'm pretty sure it's actually just a glitch in the game <laughs> and not a reference to kids tea posing because... I just kind of stand in there for a while. <laughs> there goes Reginald. Yeah, let's go. I'm gonna T-pose as long as they T-pose. It's not as easy as it looks, honestly. Oh, there we go. All right, arms down everybody, good job. Although they were thinking about T-posing. Maybe that is a thing. <laughs> I legitimately don't know. All right, what's on for today? What class is this? Maths class, let's go. 
That looks still like my exam schedule though. I'm very energized, which is nice to see. Very unusual for us. Think about Crush, let's think about Sydney. The fundamentals. A crazy math problem about 100 llamas is unlikely to have real world application, but fundamental math is an everyday part of life. For example, bills, which actually I think I'm gonna have to pay today. So yes, that is true. Budgeting around life expenses and luxury goods involves estimates and quantitative concepts. How should Reginald approach the mathematics of life? Uh, Google, ask others for help. Well, performance loss, dang it. Uh, Reginald scoffs at the idea of mastering mathematics alone, a reaction that doesn't sit well with his teacher. I mean, well, yeah, but like in life, if you're having a problem, especially with bills and budgeting, I mean, you can ask people for help. And quite frankly, like you should ask people for help if you need it. So you know what, teacher, teach, you're wrong. Britta, you don't know anything. Ms. Ebert, what do you know? Oh, I think, it, did I send a skill point? I think I did. All right, think about my crush. Ah, oh, Sydney, oh no, that's a bongo drum. All right, all right, I'm gonna be friendly with you. I really like your earrings. That's my heartfelt compliment. I don't, yeah, I like your earrings, they're cool. Yeah! And you know, if you get approval by, oh, okay. They did not like that, sorry. They're like, they're like please don't talk to me. <laughs> Leave me alone. No, I'm telling you, it's cool. And now I'm just gonna study for my exams. You don't have to stay here, you can leave. Oh, positive interaction. Look at this, we might actually have a friend. All right, we've um, finished our st like, oh, no, 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 don't play some old. Can't, no, 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 oh, dang it. Put that back in the inventory. I can't do my homework yet. I was kind of hoping I could do it now. Well, while we're here, let's prank the whiteboard. <laughs> got him. Am I hungry? Not really. I'm actually in a pretty good mood. I just gotta go to the toilet, which we'll do in a second. Let's go prank the other whiteboard too. <laughs> let's waste all my lunch break doing this. There we are. Oh, yes, we got to Oh, wait, no. <laughs> <laughs> I got so excited and my listing expired. Nobody, nobody bought it. Uh, okay, let's um, sell outfit, try again. All right, so 160 was too much. What about 150? I'm just gonna prank the other whiteboard now. Come on, I just need the money. Let's prank the other whiteboard. <laughs> oh no, May's social bunny password just got stolen. The prankster has already posted an incriminating post on our behalf. Oh yeah, let's check it out. <laughs> uh, wait, Reginald, I went a little too hard, but it was supposed to be just a friendly pillow fight. Wait, I didn't post that. <laughs> Unless I just autonomously post, hang on. Not really sure to be honest. Hang on, I gotta, can I add May to my contact list? Do I know May? Oh, I oh wait, May is, the, oh, someone saw the principal's one? Oh, <laughs> that is epic. <laughs> I thought the principal was like letting us know that someone else did it. <laughs> Wait, how do you do that? That's so funny. I want to steal someone's password. Regain passion. What is that? I'll try. Regaining. <laughs> we pranked by the light pods. Okay, now I'm focused. Okay, cool. All right, let's go use the toilet as well. You are busting. No, no, I got 30 minutes. Yeah, let me just go to the toilet first. I think I got time. <laughs> My prank is still there. Got him. All right, is anyone going to class? It feels like no one's going to class. Oh, wait, I'm in. Wait, what class am I in? Oh, here we go, 10 science class. All right, so the teacher started teaching. No one is in this class. Uh, I am though. Hey, what's up? <laughs> Took the front row seat. I didn't even get to see like the result of my pranking. Like I wasn't even in the room. Oh, cheerleading starts in about an hour. Oh, here, here's everyone. You guys, you're a little late. Like real late. There's like 10 minutes of class left. Alrighty. That was a good day of school. Look at that golden chair. Mm-hmm. End of day. Reginald impressed his teachers and learned a lot. There you go. Now I'm gonna jump home. I know I'm stinky, but I'm gonna go home first because I don't have time to shower before cheer practice. Oh, my bills. Yeah, that goes on my money. <laughs> uh, oh, how do I pay my bills? Uh, home? Oh, there we go. All right. Yeah, I know you're stinky, but I gotta pay the bills. There we go. All right, time for cheer practice. Off you go. All right, let's see which one's higher performance, less fun. Less social, goof off, higher fun, less performance. I think our fun is okay at the moment. Make friends, mm, I don't really do that. Let's practice hard. Oh, here we go, what's this? Team practice, just before starting practice for the day. Um, I mean, practice is nearly over, so it's a little late, but anyway. The team notices that a rival club member has messed with your gear. This will really set back practice for the day while the team cleans up the mess and makes arrangements for replacements. Reginald feels upset about the audacity of the other team to do something like this. He can get payback by doing the same to them or try and talk things through the rival team in an attempt to make things better. I mean, look, the good option is make amends, but hey, you did it to me, I'm doing it back. Together, the team felt united getting revenge, but Reginald can't help but feel like maybe revenge was not the right way. Oh, Dina Caliente wants to purchase my clothes. Yeah, fantastic. All right, so that's good news. Oh, I got promotion. Yeah. 
Promoted to cheerleading teammate. Wait, what was I before? <laughs> cheerleading, like, was I not even a cheerleader? <laughs> He's also uh, received the following bonus, cheer team flag. Cool. I, I don't really know what after school activity promotions do for us. Oh, next promotion is cheer captain. Reginald's getting really good at this and his moves are starting to be in unison with the rest of the team. What do you mean starting to be in unison? You should have already been in unison. You're in the cheer team. Keep on building fitness, practicing cheer skills and make it to practice. And soon enough, Reginald might be eligible for cheer captain. All right, I need one more skill point and we're there. All right, uh, the other thing, let's sell my clothes on Trendy. 150, yeah. Oh, sweet, we're rich. 12 followers. Remember that having more followers makes it easier to sell fashion looks on Trendy. Yeah, that's cool. So how do I check? Oh, level two entrepreneur as well. Brimming with great biz ideas can now also promote his hustle by advertising online. Do I have to use a computer to do that? Or can I do it here? Take a vacation day, join after school activity, quit job. Check social media timeline. Um, so wait, is that? So my followers on there, how do I check my followers? What if I say add to my Simstagram story? Is that where my followers are? I don't know where these followers are. <laughs> I don't know what system they're part of. Okay, here we go. 307 followers, hello. Okay, yeah, so it's part of Simstagram as my follow account, okay. All right, well let's, first of all, what happens if I can look at, whoops, look at Trendy on my phone? About Trendy, browse, check, oh, check followers. Okay, that I can also just do that, right, okay. Oh. Oh, okay. No, I have 307 Instagram followers with 25 trendy followers. Right, it's different. And I just check it there. That makes sense. Browse, check follow, check the, check the latest trends. Ah, then maybe that's what we should do. So we can try and make an outfit that fits the trend. Preppy trend is high right now. Polish trend is low. Okay, let's go make a preppy look. I got $164 to thrift with. I'm gonna thrift hard. Oh, fashion show, what's this? Are you ready to show off your sublime style? Gain the applause of other fashionistas at the Thrift Tea Fashion Show? Oh, what is this and where is it? <laughs> okay, well, let me create a look first. God, I stink so bad. Is there a shower here? No, there isn't. It's fine, we'll be okay. Well, we need to make a preppy look. So let's see what we can do. All right, let's filter by style, preppy. Here we go. Oh yeah, that's a preppy shirt if I've ever seen one. And then we need to go preppy pants. What do we got? I do kind of like these like checkered one. Oh, maybe we should go like bold on the pants, you know? Oh, I have a pop of color, yeah. This is gonna be a full prep outfit. Oh my God, these shoes. Oh yeah, you gotta have like the boat shoes. Heck yeah. I guess it's brown, that's fine. I might change the color of the top actually. I, I feel like I'm not liking it anymore. You know, I feel like, I think it doesn't suit. You know, I do like the default one actually. Oh yes, it totally goes with those pants. Here we go, now we're talking. Oh my gosh, those shoes. <laughs> Can I afford a hat? And also, is it even, <gasps> oh, oh no, the crown is out of stock. <laughs> So wait, did I actually like unlock that for usage now? That's kind of cool, because <laughs> I'm from royalty. All right, there's no preppy hats. I mean, that kind of makes sense, I think. They're like sunglasses. Oh my gosh, look at these sunglasses. Preppy, here we go. What we got? Too expensive, okay, I can't, I, oh, that's pretty good. Let's go with this. This is gonna be named E-Girl. No, it's not gonna be named Y2K. You know, it kind of does look like a 90s look anyway, so let's go with that. All right, so that's our preppy look, which we will sell and it's gonna be epic. But first, we're gonna use it, we're gonna wear it for the fashion show. So we can click here and say wear outfit. Okay, yeah, I'm a little stink. Maybe I shouldn't wear it. Um, I'm this stinky. <laughs> yeah! All right, how do I show off my, how, how do I do this fashion show thing? Fashion show? Fashion show? You said there was a fashion show, so I want it. Look, do you like my outfit? Show a fashion look. There we go, let's just do that. <laughs> yeah! Look at me go. You like it? Anyone? Oh, you know what? I think maybe they're looking at it. You you, you wanna you wanna buy this? Oh, okay. He's like, okay, I don't wanna buy it now. Maybe before you wore it. Alright, let's sell this outfit on trendy. Now this is a trending outfit. Let's go 195. 50 bucks. Profit. Pure profit. <laughs> let's try that. Alright, we gotta well I stink, but that's fine. I gotta do my homework. I'm gonna do that here. Okay, or not. Hang on. Do your homework, please. Here we go. Going outside. Because if we do our homework one more time, we got this whole level complete. Oh, what is this? You're doing like a sweet po- Oh, fashion show, show contestant. Wait, how do I join the fashion show? I, I, fashion enthusiast? Fashion show contestant? I want to join the fashion show, but I want to, I don't know how to do it. <laughs> Someone left that bourbon tea on the floor too. What about fashion trends? Thrift store owner. Maybe I need to talk to you. I don't know. I don't know how to do this. Maybe I already did, oh, no, everyone's leaving. All right, see you, everyone. Guess that's the end of the fashion show. <laughs> oh, the thrift store owner. We should probably get to know you because I'm going to be here a lot. Oh, okay, bye. <laughs> yeah, every time I try to get to know someone, they just leave. All right, earn an A, earn and keep an A. 
Oh, finished school as an A student three days in a row. I'm still a C student though. How do I even get an A? Okay, actually, I think, you know what? I think I will get it now. I've got the tick. I should go up to B, right? <laughs> wait, how's my homework 25% done? I just finished it. Oh, wait, maybe, wait, what? No, it must be done. I finished it. I put my inventory, I don't know. A 10 career day, okay. We got 810 points, by the way. Is there anything actually useful I could get? Um, I mean, maybe over a thousand, but oh, entrepreneurial. More likely to get promoted in careers. That's good. That's what we need. All right. Well, let's uh, let's go to. We gotta go to school. <laughs> I, I gotta go to school because I got a shower. Hey, it's me. It's Reginald. I'm just here to have a shower. Is that cool? Thanks, teach. Literally no one here. I'm just gonna let myself in. Oh, we should post on social media again, shouldn't we? Um, let's see, new post, what do we got? Uh, post about lunch, post about pranking, cheerleading practice, we got a lot of stuff, you know. Post about new outfit, energized narrative. Feel free to stop and stare, I'm looking fresh to death. Yeah! Post about pranking. Oh yeah, confident as well, confident prank. About to go down in history as the ultimate prank master. Yeah! Also, I'm gonna say love hot eyes to that one. And I'm also gonna post about cheerleading practice as energized. You know, I'm positive now. I feel like we're living a good life. We hear it, we cheer it. We've got lots of pride and spirit. Ignite, excite, look at us, we're dynamite. Kissy cheek. Now friends, Sydney, I'm gonna message you. I wanna say a flirty message, you know, why not? <laughs> I've got an idea, you, me, and a boba tea with two straws. <laughs> oh, um, I can't really afford that though, so I don't know if I would've messaged that, Reginald. <gasps> Molly messaged me, your style is everything. Teach me your ways. Um, friendly message. Molly, have you thought about taking up a guitar? I think you'd crush it. Um, that doesn't really, okay. Well, that's not really a response to what, but... She was saying, but okay. All right, a little hungry, but that's okay. We'll just eat in the morning. We got to get home and sleep because we we always have to get up really early. We got we got coffee work at 5 a.m. It's tough, okay? You know, pillow fight with Jack. Wait, who? Yeah, let's do it. Let's pillow fight. Jacqueline, where are you? Let's pillow fight on my bed in a field. Oh, it didn't work. <laughs> I don't know who it was, but whatever. Anyone want to buy my trendy outfit? It's pretty good. Hype neutral? Why can't I hype it up more? I got work in an hour. Get the energy to max. Oh, get up for work. Go, go, go. <laughs> oh no, you're embarrassed. Oh no. Oh no. Growing out of control. Reginald has found his hair follicles have gone through a growth spurt. If it doesn't get under control, his hair is going to become a battleground of tangled and matted hair. Look, he's got his like morning shadow. <laughs> and he's got his acne going on as well here. Growing out of control. Reginald woke up to even worse acne. I guess I should probably do something about it. <laughs> But that'll have to wait for next episode. We'll be back next time. Uh, Reginald will be going to work in a little bit of money. Hopefully we'll sell that outfit on Trendy, get some more followers, make another outfit, you know, work our way up. We'll work our way up the cheerleading ladder as well. You know, I think things are going pretty well, albeit we're still a C student. I think we could probably try when we're at school, make sure we get those tasks done. I think the biggest problem early on was my needs were just so low. Trying to get enough energy and then fun to actually do the stuff was so tough. But I think we're on the up and up now. Thanks for watching guys. I'll see you next time and have an awesome day.